opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. c4 builds a strong center by controlling the important d5 square and creates a square for the knight to come to c3 without blocking the c-pawn. The king's Indian defense prepares to develop the bishop to g7, allowing white to build up a strong center which black will later try to undermine. And c3 prepares the e2-e4 pawn push and helps control the d5 square. Bg7 puts the bishop on the long diagonal in a move called a fianchetto. e4 takes full control of the center. d6 controls the e5 square and allows the light squared bishop to develop. f3 supports the e4 pawn, and prepares to develop the dark squared bishop to e3 and the queen to d2, a common attacking setup versus fianchetto systems. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. b3 supports the d4 pawn, white is preparing qd2 and possibly castling queenside. c5 takes space in the center and attacks the d4 pawn. And ge2 develops the knight toward the center and supports the d4 pawn. And c6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the pawn on d4. d5 attacks the knight, closes the center and gains space in the center. This move puts the knight on a safer square. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This threatens to win a knight. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. Takes back. This threatens to kick a knight. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. This threatens to kick a knight. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. This threatens to kick a knight. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This moves the knight to safety. Master Games It is the last book move. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. This threatens to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is best. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is an inaccuracy. There was only one good move there. This ignores an opportunity to take an outpost with a knight. It is a mistake. This is a fair move. It is good. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. It is excellent. This ignores an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is an inaccuracy. The game is still close to equal, but white lost their advantage. It is a mistake. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a miss. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. This threatens to win material. It is best. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. Recaptures. This threatens to win material. It is best. This simultaneously reveals an attack on a bishop and checks the king. It is good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. 
It is a great move. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Capturing that pawn wins material. It is excellent. This threatens to win material. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to block an attack on a vulnerable queen. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a pawn. This stops the opponent from being able to win material. It is a great move. This threatens to win material. This stops the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is best. This is the only good move. This threatens to fork pieces. This prevents the opponent from being able to win material. It is a great move. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well. 